11-year-old boy were killed in a grisly road accident that occurred along the eastern Abibas at uh, Kamakis in Ruai. According to the eyewitnesses' accounts, the drunk driver named Cosmos Mutembe was a spitting leading to the loss, to loss of control that swept a tuk-tuk that had occurred the three passengers. The deceased have been um, overtaken to Kenyatta University funeral home as the driver faces the police. On Sunday morning, this online video of Cosmos Mutembe surfaced online. Mutembe found himself in the wrong side of his driving skills, causing an uproar upon the death of three people with him surviving. The eyewitness in the area who spoke before the media stated that the vehicle Toyota Prado was driven too fast at around 6.30 in the morning before losing control, hitting a tuk-tuk and a Nissan. They say that the driver was drunk. Have you ever seen a dead person, the passengers that were carried by the tuk-tuk died on the spot with the efforts to save them rain dry. The bodies of the disease that included an 11-year-old, a lady of 43, and a 29-year-old man have been preserved at the Kenyatta University and Referral Hospital as the injured who are in the Nissan rush to Kenyatta University Hospital. Mutembe, who is the main cause of the accident, is in police custody, and as Ruiru Commander of Police Cecilia Kemboya Farms, he received an alcohol blood test to determine if indeed he drank and drove. In addition, Kemboya stated that the area has witnessed rampant cases of road accidents, more so the one in Kamakis at the Eastern Bypass. <laughs> Elsewhere, the same case has been witnessed in Kajedo County, where two people have died on the spot at Roadblock area, Namanga Road, as the vehicle they were traveling in was involved in an accident this Sunday afternoon. <laughs> Nilikuwa kuna watu wanne, wawili kama moja amekufa tu hapa hapa. Wawili wameumia sana. Wakachukuliwa akapeleka hospitali. Kama barabara ikiangaliwa serikali angalie na aweke makakati wa sharia. Kama ngombe ikiwekwa kwa barabara ikiguzwa, basi sasa mwenye aliweka ndio atakuwa na hatia. Kitu kama hiyo ingetusaidia kusema ukweli. Ile kitu tunaweza kuomba serikali yetu kama wanaweza tusaidia, waweze tuwekea bumps ili ajari tuweze kuipungua juu kama wakati wa kiangazi wanyama wamekuwa wengi wanatokelezea barabarani na unakuja unapata accident inatokelezea The National Transport and Safety Authority NTSA has so far confirmed 3,541 fatalities and 7,236 injuries in less than nine months. With the rising number of road accidents in the country, the Kenya National Highways Authority, Kenha, has been advised to renovate the roads as motorists to take precautions while driving. Mosta Sokech, Lookup TV.